rising from the ashes, calling you by shame Time to take it back, I'm reclaiming my pride I crowned you king, but you ain't worth the real Alright everyone, let's take a look and see what's going on here What is it that we need to know at this time? What is it that we need to know? Spirit, show us Mm. Divine union, spirit, soulmate, spiritual guidance, okay? Looks like that somebody's being guided here. It could be being guided towards another person, okay? Definitely a spiritual union or this is um, spirit guiding someone to someone. There, to put some, something's coming together. There's been some missing pieces to a puzzle, Somebody's been trying to figure some things out. Somebody has been missing the key information regarding a particular situation. And I feel like somebody's being guided to the missing pieces here. All right. So if it's not a divine union coming together, this is spirit guiding someone to find out the truth about something that they've been trying, you know, trying to put the pieces together about. Mm-hmm. Healing, temporary relief, and covering the issues because somebody's been covering something. All right, somebody has been putting a bandage over a wound when it really needs to air out. Something needs to be, you know, something needs to be aired out here. And I, it looks like spirit is guiding someone to see the truth, and this could involve a water sign: Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. All right. There could be a water sign that's covering the issues or there's a situation that a water sign is finding out about, right? Definitely Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio involved. Let's, what else is going on here with this? This could be involving someone's health, okay? Or this is a warning that somebody needs to be careful when it comes to a situation because something is not safe or not healthy for another person to be dealing with. Okay. So what could be. This could be a health scare. This could be someone trying to figure out. What's going on with their health. Their body. And there's something that someone needs to. Maybe go to the doctor. Stop trying to. Add, put temporary. You know. Relief onto something. There's something more. That an aspirin cannot fix here. Alright. This could involve a pregnancy motherhood nurturing here or this is a mother figure who is figuring some things out someone could be figuring out realizing that they're pregnant this could be somebody here who has been trying to wonder figure out like what's going on with their health well somebody could be pregnant or this mother figure needs to be cautious about someone yeah could be needing to cleanse spiritually protect themselves because there's something that someone doesn't mm, set up plotting and trap when I tell you before I actually started this these cards came out the exact same card set it set up water sign the healing covering the issues these three cards came out before so there is a there's a setup here there's a trap. Someone could be trying to trap a water sign in a situation here. So someone needs to be careful that they don't walk themselves into a situation that is not easy for them to get out of here, okay? Can I get more on this, what this is about? This could be somebody walking right into a trap, getting someone pregnant. Hmm. not realizing that that was what somebody wanted all along or there's health concerns that someone was trying to, you know, um, pass along to somebody else. It could be anything. You have gaining success, getting support, and helping others. So there's somebody out here who's getting success, someone who likes to help others. They're getting support from other people as well. Okay, this could be someone who is... Um, Climbing a ladder of success or they are experiencing positive changes in their life. And I feel like this may be the person 
who needs to be careful because there is a setup, there is a plot, and there is a trap to, I want to know what this is, what this plot is. Yeah, separation, divorce, and broken agreement. Someone could be going through a divorce. Or there's a, there's a separation here that involves a water sign where someone may be wanting to trap someone. This is cheese on here. You know, there could be a rat. There could be somebody who snitches and tells. Somebody could be watching someone online. Yeah, somebody could be online and somebody's watching someone get success, get support. And there could be a separation between two people. And someone may be trying to plot something. Like they want to come and try to heal something. Heal a connection. Heal a friendship. With someone. But there's a reason why this person is coming around. because, And they're not really telling you. Like I said, this could be a mother figure. Somebody could be trying to trap someone up as well. There's a toxic person that's looking right at this mother figure for real. So whoever this is, they need to cleanse their energy and protect themselves from being trapped. Because somebody's watching. Tell me more about this person that's watching. New path, lighted path, and escape. So somebody wants to come towards another person to escape something else. They want to take a different route now, okay? What's going on with this person? that now they want to take a new path. It could be an air sign, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini, who or someone with these placements that is trying to escape, take a new path here. Maybe someone doesn't want to be toxic anymore. Maybe someone realizes who their divine partner is and they were missing the clues in the past and now they want to heal something. All right, but I don't like set up, fly, and trap being out here. Because this could be someone who, who is, they're separated and yeah, somebody could be separating from someone and it's like somebody's trying to find a way to, um, I mean, it may not be to harm a person. It could just be that somebody's so damn toxic that their way of trying to make someone be in their life is to trap them or put them in a position where they can't leave. And I don't like that. Mm, that's weird. Yeah, marriage proposal and commitment. So this could be somebody who's married and there could be a separation or a divorce. Somebody could be watching another person who is like a divine partner and they're trying to plot and figure out a way to stop this person. This could be somebody's ex. Somebody could be going in a new direction and they're wanting to, you know, be with a, be with someone else. But there's toxicity surrounding them or surrounding uh, an ex or somebody who they're separating from. Child. Tell me more what's going on. Tell me the story. <laughs> Yeah, so you got somebody who is in regret. There's this air sign energy here. So somebody has strong air placements here. Someone could also be a Scorpio too with water and air out here. Somebody could have strong Scorpio, strong air. Somebody is in regret. Somebody is crying over spilled milk. They may have uh, abandoned a situation or if this is your story, you may have abandoned this person, left this person alone. King of Sword, this person here um, could be trying to make a decision, figure out a plan, come up with some type of way to um, maybe conversate with you, but they could be blocked. They could be restricted right now. Okay. Um, and this person, this person, I'm getting clever. Somebody's trying to come up with a clever idea here. Let's see. What's this clever idea? Someone is also up and down in their emotions one minute they 
they're crying over spilled milk. The next minute, they're plotting. Yeah, page of swords. This is somebody watching someone trying to come up with a plan that they think is like outsmarting someone. But there's deception, and I feel like somebody is going to see through it. Somebody's going to lay a trap that's going to cause them, or somebody already did this, lay a trap that's going to cause them to fall right into it. Okay, whoever this setup plotting trap is, they they are um, they're patiently watching. This could be someone who's very, very defensive, protective. Someone here who needs to think before they speak. So somebody could, could I'm hearing outbursts. Some more about this page of sword. Lots of air energy coming out here right now. So someone could be watching an air sign or someone could be an air sign or with strong placements who can make, can be very smart intelligent this could be someone who may want to talk but their words can come off very harsh the king of sword is not a very you know they're very cutthroat very to the point but with the page of sword this could be someone who can also be very defensive they need to think before they speak this is someone who can be very immature as well okay but somebody has an idea and and whatever this idea is hierophant this is dealing with commitment tradition this is someone who's talking about marriage, okay? So somebody could be interested in getting into a long-term commitment with someone, but there's also separation, divorce. So is somebody coming up with the right idea to try to keep something here going while they're still go you know, involved in another situation? What is this here? Because we've got marriage, and then we also have divorce out here. The Empress. Yeah, somebody wants a commitment... With an empress or there's a pregnant person out here. There's somebody, a mother figure here that I feel someone has their eye on. They could have already been married to this person. They could they could be married, but it's like what's going on with this mother figure? The tower. Yeah, something something here is being revealed, exposed here. Something is crumbling down. And it has everything to do with somebody trying to cover up the real issue. What's the real issue here? That they have two choices? That they have an option here? That someone's been kind of looking on the other side, trying to see exactly what they want? This is someone who has a decision to make, whether to stay or to go. I'm telling you, somebody toxic... Or this person could have health concerns is looking at this this empress energy and whatever this plot is maybe they're planning to divorce someone else why is divorce out here look at the mm -hmm. this is a ten of cups with the moon somebody could be hiding a marriage or someone is hiding the fact a family situation there's fear around it or someone could be yeah the will of fortune something is coming back around there's the emperor the emperor is coming back around and there's a king of pentacles and there's a six of sword okay somebody here i feel doesn't want Someone could be trying to find a way to keep someone, right? And there could be another person that's coming in to offer commitment long term. But this person here is still trapped, stuck in a situation, whether it's a separation, a divorce, whatever that is. They eyeing, they're eyeing someone else. And if they could figure out a way to 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 make things happen, where they could be an emperor here to this emperor and a king of pentacles to someone else that's what it feels like it feels like someone wants to move on to calmer waters but at the same token there's a need for them to hmm. completely end something here someone can no longer cover up the issues so this could be you. You could be this empress. You could be this emperor. There's someone here who needs to completely close out a cycle before they come back around. Because they, if not, 
it, it just looks like something is going to be toxic. I understand that someone may want to go in a different direction. Somebody has a choice to make. Or they will very soon. There's judgment. Yep. Someone has a choice to make. Either you're going to come out of watching this empress and actually make a move because somebody else is watching this empress as well. And if there's somebody who's in a marriage and in a family dynamic, they, they could be going, you know, there could be talks of separation and divorce. But it's like somebody here is dancing around the issue, you know, maybe not putting forth the effort to get it done. What's up with this situation? The devil. Yeah, this is somebody who's holding on to a karmic situation. Okay, secrets, deception, codependency. All right, so somebody could be very obsessed with a with the person. They could be obsessed with this empress energy, but they have like a mother figure or some other situation. What's this? The Knight of Pentacles with the Four of Cups. Like something is taking too long. Something is taking too long. Is somebody want to try to figure out a way? Is somebody juggling? What's this? Seven of Cups. Yeah. Trying to keep a situation open, multiple choices, procrastinating, not getting it done. Yeah, so somebody's going to be rejected because now somebody's getting bored. All right, so if this is someone who's involved with a person that keeps saying that they're going to, uh, I'm going to divorce this person or this is over. No, somebody's, somebody's bored with it. Somebody's going to be um, a missed opportunity to someone here, okay? Because there's somebody who's sitting here under a tree depressed. Because they're not, they're not making the move to change their situation. Somebody else is coming in to get this person. Okay, I, I'm. Uh, that's what I'm looking at. There's, there's somebody who is eyeing the empress, but they're stuck. And here's this page of wands. This is somebody here who is already fascinated with this empress, and they see this empress as wish fulfillment. There is a, a situation that's about to blow up in someone's face because somebody's about to get a new offer here somebody's about to get a new love offer all right yep for yep something's being laid to rest so this could also be the empress saying you know what you know the empress could be leaving someone going through a divorce and there's someone new that's coming in that they're going to build with here somebody's about to lay a situation completely to the side and they're going to experience success in another direction and this person who who's been taking their time how they're gonna feel we already know but how are they gonna feel because I already see regret out here yeah someone someone took their time someone's playing around like mm -hmm, they're gonna be very defensive they're gonna want to step in and fight for what they feel is theirs no 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 see this is this is a somebody who has wasted enough of your time yep five of swords this is somebody who who um wants to win at all costs and they want to step up and you know want to um be aggressive and be intimidating after the fact because they took too long this is someone who took too long to do something and they were busy trying to find ways to keep something here going instead of completely ending a situation so now when the new offer comes in, they're going to miss out. So this is this could be somebody being warned. Like you are about to miss out on an opportunity because somebody else is coming in. There's a king of pentacles. There's an emperor. The emperor and the empress are together or should be there a divine match. But the king of pentacles is out here and that's somebody who's loyal and committed. So somebody's about to get a loyal partnership, a, a commitment. And somebody else here, look, look at the Knight of the Fool. Somebody taking a risk, and I think that's the Knight. Yeah, the Knight of Cups. Somebody's going to take a risk. This could, you know, for some of you, it could be, you know, somebody making a decision to, to separate, and somebody could be trying to find a way to get out of something. But I'm telling you, if they don't play around, somebody's about to, to find out. What's this, it feel? Uh, somebody want to be in control. Somebody wants thinks that they can outsmart everybody. That they can hold, juggle two situations. There's a new person that's coming in. And it's like somebody's obsessed 
with this divine feminine yeah someone wants to reconcile but may not have changed certain patterns of behavior you may need to proceed with caution or refuse the offer can't make it up this is somebody here who wants to come in and find a way to keep you without changing someone wants to come forward with information that may change the situation that's this new person that's coming in and saying you know what you single i'm single let's do this there's somebody about to be taken off the market here because another person is living a double life they're married or they're involved in another situation and they're hiding it they could also be hiding their sexual fantasies or preferences because the devil is out here somebody could you know be into some weird ass stuff but we're not going to talk about that but there's somebody who is um yeah and this person is going to go through karma here but because they're refusing to learn the spiritual lesson okay they did something against the divine being or they refused to change a toxic pattern karma is coming for somebody who refused to change they refused they knew that they needed to, to heal they needed to deal with their issues so say for example this wasn't about marriage somebody could have gone through a divorce married someone or whatever somebody knew that the decision that they were making was not right but they stay in it they kept doing it they wouldn't change and now somebody is left to deal with their their the karma from their toxicity Somebody could be abusive, um, you know, have codependency issues. Someone could have been be obsessed with another person, secretly watching them. Yeah, it's like somebody wants to marry someone and be with someone after after they completely sabotage the connection. So it kind of feels like you know there is someone that may have two kind of weird options. Let's just go two bad options. Like somebody could be married and another person is over here in regret because they lost you. So there's a divine feminine, divine masculine who may have ended something with two different people. One, because they refused to change a situation, maybe a family situation. And another person that was in regret because they refused to change. So something new is coming in for the divine feminine, divine masculine here. Bottom of the deck, king of cups. All right. This is new love that's coming in for someone all right so if you resonate with this then you can expect something different coming in and it may not be any of these options take it how it resonates all right it may not be any of these options that's crazy wow and i forgot yeah there is a king of sword out here too maybe there's more than two options for somebody it, it just seems like something's being cleared out all the past yep all the past connections karmic connections are being cleared out um someone is now establishing firm boundaries with the people around them realizing that these people are karmic so there are people that are coming around to apologize in this season here because they they see that the divine feminine divine masculine were the most stable of the options that they had all right so i do see that there is a stable connection that's coming in for the divine feminine divine masculine after these karmic connections are completely cleared cleared out all right old wounds and childhood issues need revisiting so some of you are still going through the healing from these past connections and these people keep popping up they're watching they're stalking yep interference you know they got third party drama going on or they <laughs> Some of them are still involved in uh, with other people, but they want you to forgive them. Uh, you know, you're on your way to success. Whoever this is that's gaining success, getting support, and you could be doing things that help others. You're drawing in these past energies that want to um, want your forgiveness. It says trust. It is safe to trust in this situation and self self care. Clear your energy. We got that again. Somebody needs to clear their energy and focus on themselves before doing anything. It's time for you to focus on yourself. Don't be distracted by what's coming towards you because it looks like a few of these people are just in regret, or they will be in regret over the fact that they took too long to get out of situations, to get out. You know, to um, come out of this karmic energy. They took too long. 
And this is people seeing you as wish fulfillment, but it's like you're no longer interested or you're no longer attracted. Whoever you are, you are. You could be pregnant or you could be on your way to experiencing lots of growth and abundance and new ideas that are very successful for you, very prosperous for you. And I feel like these people are having a, a realization as to who you really are. And, you know, it, it, hey, there's nothing wrong with um, you having a realization, but realize that you need to stay over there. <laughs> like, have your epiphany over there because the divine feminine and the divine masculine has done enough work on themselves to where they don't need to go backwards. They don't need to go backwards towards people that are still trying to figure themselves out, figure out where they want to be. We're not doing that with Darnell Jones, okay? Darnell Jones or whatever his name, where I want to be, no, no, okay? Yep, surrender to what is. Flow with what is instead of fighting it. When you can't change a situation, compassionately accepting it exactly as it is, it's going to bring you peace. So a lot of you have accepted that it is what it is with these people. You're moving on. You freed yourself here. You're open to change. You're open to what the universe has for you. You have this attitude of going with the flow right now. You're not taking everything serious. You're you're focused on the things that are important to you, the things around you that are, you know, um, fruitful. You're not focusing on these dead issues anymore here. Yep, and you've let go of resentment. You hold, you're not holding on to resentment anymore. You're forgiving others and their shortcomings, and you're keeping it moving towards positive things in your life. That's exactly where I feel you guys are. I love this message. I mean, I didn't know where it was going at in the beginning, but this is letting me know that a lot of you are freeing yourself, and these karmic connections, these people are going to be coming back around because they see, they're watching you. This is more than one person. For some of you, it's... It's at least three people um, that were stuck or they couldn't figure things out in their life. Um, like I said, water, air, there's some of everything out here. But um, you do have something coming in for you. Is just stay focused on what you have going on. Don't lose sight of that because a lot of these people are distractions to throw you off, to you know get you to start looking at them again. And then next thing you know... They come in as though they know what they want. The next thing you know, you realize they're still in the same old shit. Nobody have time. It says, I remove myself from negative vibing people and choose to remain unbothered. You're choosing to be unbothered. You're getting away from these people that don't know where they're going. They don't know what they want. No, it's not a match for you, okay? So this is what I have for you guys. Um, if you feel like this is your story, leave it in the comments and I will see you guys on the next one. From the ashes calling you by shame Time to take it back, I'm reclaiming my pride I crowned you king, but you ain't worth